Hello everybody and welcome back to Zendale's Gaming Chair. Last time we beat the Glitz Pit and moved on to the next chapter. And we're kicking back up where we left off. Last time all my equipment got a little got a little messed up, so you probably couldn't hear me, but you saw all the footage of me taking out Rockhawk and the ultimate villain, uh, Grubba, who is using the Crystal Star to steal uh, his best champion's power to make himself, you know, the best and possibly take over the world. I don't know what his ultimate plan was to just take over the Glitz Pit or what, but he already kind of owned it. I don't know what he was doing there, but Grotus here has... Uh, once again, brought in the Shadow Sirens to enact their next plan, which we'll get into more hopefully today, and we'll figure out where we're going. And she's officially bored, she says. What you doing, Tech? Scoot up closer to the mic just in case. I tried not fiddling around so much with my equipment, so let's see. I hope the sound quality is good because I can't exactly hear myself on camera. But let's see where Grotus is and ask him something. I recently obtained specific information that brought an issue to my attention. Grotus is keeping secrets from his best computer. Even he knows it's smarter than him. Looking like a soldier. Oh yeah, this is the... You gotta mix a potion. I will tell you. The elevator is active. This is the memory one. Currently soldiers in the vicinity. Nobody looks at the see-through elevator, huh? Alrighty then. Go this way, maybe. It always pays to explore, you know. Let's try the other way. I really don't get why my equipment... Maybe it's my microphone, maybe... Well, here's where we go. Maybe someone can tell me I use a Yeti. A blue Yeti. And I'm hoping... I've been warned that people... Uh, don't favor them too much anymore. But that's all I have and it's probably all I'll get. I'm just fumbling around, just trying to talk. Locker, there you are. Instead of like the last game where it's like a magic spell, you just gotta just stuff yourself into one of these. And anyone can do it, it's Peach. Yeah, I use a Blue Yeti. A lot of people say they have problems with it. But sometimes it does, but it hasn't 
catastrophically failed. Usually I go back to it in a couple days or so, much like I am now, trying to get more episodes up. You smell nice. This is wrong, dude. You guys don't care about personal hygiene? So I don't know if anyone has a link to a fairly inexpensive one that they like. I guess throw it down in the comments if you prefer. Or we'll see. I'll find a way. I'll find a way to make make things better. Well, excuse me. Go this way. Alright, Grotus. What's going on? I have no interest in that woman. What that woman says, we're locked up in the room. Nothing odd, just just curious about what we're working for, man. Okay, this isn't the potion one like I thought, but there how exactly couldn't have like a stealth segment or something Instant. Carlos is talking about the legendary treasure that requires the crystal stars and the thousand year door. Who knows what it means? Good night, Princess Peach. Yes. Let's see what Bowser's up to. Shooting Mario. What if I'm a fool? I mean, let's go. Well, I should know about the Crystal Star. Mario already got it. leave. We can always come back and kick Rockhawk's butt again. For experience. 
and be a little be a little dull but maybe if I need need to level up it it wouldn't hurt just to do it off screen or whatever if you guys like to see me do it again and say something I don't have those shoes Check the ticket. Now we can go smash some blocks that have been bugging me since the start of the game. We don't need to see all of that. Out, one of our strongest teammates. Though Flurry did help a lot against Rockhawk. Lip Lock definitely helped. Uh, email. I've uncovered something terrible. These things, the x knots are planning to take control of the world. It's to that end, they're searching for the crystal stars. I do not know what the crystal stars do. They open the door to oblivion. Death. How much money do I have? I have 114 coins. How much space do I have? I have plenty. Get some life shrooms. That's what we need. Those will come in handy. And we can get more money. Money, money. And we can do this. Shine Sprite. We don't have that power yet. We'll get there soon. star piece up there. We'll deal with that later. Gotcha. Yeah, I walked right into it, punk. from my boy. Do we have enough to upgrade him once? Nope, I still need one more. Not where I wanted to be. But it takes us here. I guess it's where we need to be. And I'm gonna smash those blocks first. Yep, there it is. 
That's how you do it. That's where we found the paper airplane. Right. And B, these things. And we can get around so much quicker. And we need another hammer for those things. Which eventually we will get. Upgrade the boy. Save. Just in time for a new chapter. Chozubi! There we go. What does that give him? Mini egg, check moves, shrink them. Don't, probably not as good as gold will ever be, but I think it'll help against a lot of enemies. Alright, where are we heading to next? is a metal and not a crystal, but okay. I mean, I know where we're heading next, but it's still fun to, to see, to look at, you know? favorite looking star right there. That's a red. Oof. Location of a crystal star has been recorded on the map. That shows the fourth crystal star is. Alright, frankly, where are we headed? The group that kidnapped Princess Peach is bent on world conquest. Look 
I came across held to what I thought was a preposterous theory. The book claimed that the treasure was in actuality the great cataclysm. A thousand years sank a town underground. Bum bum bum. Now things have come to this. We mustn't let them near the legendary treasure. That's all that matters. According to the map, it appears the next crystal star is in Twilight Town. Not the same Twilight Town, but, you know, maybe. To tell you the truth, I don't know much, much about the place and the rumors have heard that. As the name implies, it's perpetually dim and eerie there. Wait just a moment. There's to be a pipe to Twilight Town somewhere in Rogueport. I know where the pipe is, it's just... Oh my heck. You can't just leave the earth alone, can you? why I don't sign up to things like that. Well, we know where we're headed, we know where the pipe is. I have an idea of how to get there, which I think we will in the next episode. We'll stop for now. Just so the algorithm doesn't bury it or doesn't promote it because it's super long and a lot of people don't like long videos. I say as I made almost hour to hour and a half videos before just because there's kind of a lot to do in these games like this. But for now, I think we'll leave it here. We have our next objective and we'll deal with it and get on with our next chapter next time. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and ring the bell. You can check out my stuff a whole week early. I'm trying to get more as I have more, a little bit more time here. I'm moving into another day job here, so I might have a couple days to myself to get some stuff up. But you can check them a week early on my Patreon, which will be linked in the description. And, and with that, I'll see you guys next time.